I would love to go to Spain. So we got to figure that out. Are you thinking the stadium Santiago Bernabeu just got renewed? They I'm not thinking anything. Another. I'm not thinking anything right now. I got a whole department that works on that. I got Petro, but we'll dive in and see what's available, what's not available, and we'll start grinding and trying to make that happen. But yeah, the answer is yes. I want to do that, and I want to do it this year. And what do you think for Mexico next? You have one show this year. Uh, maybe what you just announced in Anaheim with uh, the WWE and you guys doubling dates. This arena also holds the WWE with great success. Would this be a thing that you would think about for Mexico City, maybe? Yeah, I mean, we uh, listen, this was obviously incredibly successful. Now with the opening of the PI, we, ha we have huge plans for Mexico, and, and it's not just Mexico City. I want to go all over Mexico. And just one last question. Alexa Grasso was in the commentary team today uh, for the Spanish broadcast in the U.S. Do you have a date thought out for Alexa Grasso? Do you want to do it in Noche UFC? Do you want to wait? Is there any plan for Alexa Grasso right now? We'll announce that soon. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Then, Moises yeah. Mendoza from uh, Hermosillo. Uh, I want to know, Alexa said she want to make a defense in Guadalajara. How possible can that be? And another question, uh, MLB, NFL, NBA uh, work regularly, like on a yearly basis here. Is it possible to have the UFC on a yearly basis? Uh, the answer is yes uh, to your first question, and the answer is yes to your second question. Thank Absolutely. You. Listen. We are in Mexico now. The UFC is officially here in Mexico now. We, we, we actually planted a flag here. We, ha we, have a, we have our own building here now. We have our facility. Um, we're going to be doing a lot in this country now. We're here. Thank you. Yep. Buenas noches. Este lado. How are you, sir? ¿Qué sensación le deja en general el evento en México pensando que por ahí hubo un problema que en la tribuna que pudiera eh, ser, ser motivo de alarma, no sé si para que regrese o no regrese, ¿qué, qué, le, qué sensación le deja ese problema que hubo extra octavo? Uh, what's your final feeling about the event? We know that there was a, a fight in the crowd that is not looks good uh, for the UFC, but what is uh, your final thoughts about, about this event? So the fight in the crowd doesn't look good for the UFC? I mean, that never happens. That never, literally never happens. It happened here in Mexico City. The crazy thing about that fight, when that fight broke out, it felt like it kept going forever. So I ran over there, and I was watching it. Nobody stopped it. I mean, I, I was waiting for security to come in. They just let them go till it was over. That's one of the craziest things I've ever seen. Um, I don't think it's a bad look for the UFC. It happened, and, you know... That was the end of that. I think after everybody else saw that shit, nobody else, nobody else wanted to try that again. No security. The fight just went on until the fight was over. I've never seen any shit like that in my life. It's crazy. Bueno, fue, fue una locura. La verdad, eh, no es algo que le moleste a UFC. Realmente no es que pase muy seguido en los eventos. Pasó aquí y a mí lo que me sorprendió es que no había seguridad que se parara la pelea. Yo estuve viendo pues toda la pelea hasta que terminó y afortunadamente pues bueno ya no siguió más, pero pues sí, no había seguridad. Y una pregunta más es, eh, ¿qué le deja más satisfecho de estar aquí en México? What gave you more satisfaction about coming back to Mexico? What gave me the most what? Satisfaction. Satisfaction? Um, the opening of the PI. The opening of the PI has been, um, you know, a goal of mine for a very long time. Uh, we had a place in the works. Then COVID hit. That deal fell apart. We found this new place. We got it together. We're finally here. This is something that I've been... Uh, that I've been waiting for for a long time. So it was very satisfying to walk through the gym uh, here in Mexico City.